Hi, it's Emily at the Coastal Discovery Museum. Today we're going to be reading In One Tide Pool, Crabs, Snails, and Salty Tales by Anthony D. Fredericks. Here is a coastline with pounding waves, sea splash rocks and hidden caves, with seagulls gliding out of reach and clumps of kelp tossed on the beach. This is where a tide pool lay, crowded with critters on a summer's day. This is a tide pool. A curly-haired girl with wondering eyes found crabs and fish and five-arm surprise. She carefully watched the things she found, dozen of animals all around. A questioning child, she truly cared for the tide pool home these creatures shared. Barnacles with legs so small that waved at the girl who watched them all. In one tide pool, fun to explore, a web of life on a rugged shore. These are the fish that dart and hide and find their food in the surging tide. Near barnacles with legs so small that waved at the girl who watched them all. In one tide pool, fun to explore, a web of life on a rugged shore. Anemones with stinging cells hold fast to rocks and empty shells. Friends to fish that dart and hide and find their food in the surging tide. Near barnacles with legs so small that waved at the girl who watched them all. In one tide pool, fun to explore a web of life on the rugged shore. A blood red sponge clings to the ledge, a curious creature from edge to edge. Close to anemones with stinging shells, the ones who grip the rock and shells. Neighbors to fish that dart and hide and find their food in the surging tide. Near barnacles with legs so small that waved at the girl who watched them all. In one tide pool, fun to explore, a web of life on a rugged shore. A group of snails with spiral hats glide across the bumps and flats. Beside the sponge, upon the ledge, a curious creature from edge to edge. Close to anemones with stinging cells, the ones who grip the rocks and shells. Neighbors to fish that dart and hide and find their food in the surging tide. Near barnacles with legs so small that waved at the girl who watched them all. In one tide pool, fun to explore, a web of life on the rugged shore. Thieving crabs drag borrowed rooms, shuffling across the seaweed blooms. Past the snails with spiral hats, glide across the bumps and flats. Beside the sponge upon the ledge, a curious creature from edge to edge. Close to anemones with stinging cells, the ones who grip the rocks and shells. Neighbors to fish that dart and hide and find their food in the surging tide. Near barnacles with legs so small that waved at the girl who watched them all. The one tide pool is so fun to explore a web of life on a rugged shore. A cluster of limpets, brown and white, cling to a ridge with all their might and watch the crabs with borrowed rooms shuffle across the seaweed blooms, past the snails with spiral hats that glide across the bumps and flats. Beside the sponge, upon the ledge, a curious creature from edge to edge close to anemones with stinging cells, the ones who grip the rocks and shells. Neighbors to the fish that dart and hide and find their food in the surging tide. Near barnacles with legs so small that waved at the girl who watched them all. In one tide pool, fun to explore, a web of life on a rugged shore. A knobby sea star slowly slips across the pool on feeding trips. It creeps by limpets brown and white, who tightly cling with all their might and watch the crabs with borrowed rooms shuffle across the seaweed blooms, past the snails with spiral hats that glide across the bumps and flats, beside the sponge upon the ledge, a curious creature from edge to edge, close to anemones with stinging cells, the ones who grip the rocks and shells, neighbors to fish that dart and hide 
and find their food in the surging tide. Near barnacles with legs so small that waved at the girl who watched them all. In one tide pool, fun to explore, a web of life on a rugged shore. The tide pool hugs a rocky place, a magical realm with a craggy face. It harbors all creatures, protecting each one in their own splashy world beneath the bright sun. Thanks for joining us today.